I ran the Tokyo Marathon and recently posted a video of how that went. Uh, now today, I wanted to give you a little recap though on uh, the whole experience of the marathon. Being in Tokyo was amazing. Uh, spending the days there before the race was a lot of fun. Uh, the hotel that I stayed in was across from the start line, which with uh, the cold weather was very convenient. And uh, I didn't go down to the start until 30 minutes before they closed the corrals. There was security to get through, but that was very smooth and everything else at the start was very well organized. Uh, getting to the appointed corral was very easy and with 36,000 runners, uh, the started race went down very smooth. With a mass start, of course, you get a lot of runners running together at the start of the race, but right after the start, uh, the, the course went into some really wide streets, so it, it was very easy to spread out. During the week, I already noticed how clean the streets are in Tokyo. Uh, there's not a single piece of trash on the ground. And uh, the same was during the race. Uh, I saw the odd drop gel pack, but uh, there was hardly anything on the ground at all. Uh, there were volunteers on the side of the road with garbage bags through the entire race, and uh, they made sure that the streets stayed clean during the marathon. The crowds were amazing. Uh, I think I saw more people in the crowd in funny outfits than on the course. Uh, it was really great to see that and uh, very motivating to be cheered on the entire course of the race. I found Tokyo a bit hard to navigate also because I, I can't read any of the signs anywhere, but uh, the streets also weave around and uh, sometimes you just can't really figure out where you are. Uh, the same was during the marathon. It was tough to know uh, where I was at times and even after checking the marathon course, uh, I still didn't really know. There were a lot of uh, there and back parts of the race. Uh, at the start of the race, I, I kind of enjoyed that because uh, it gave me a chance to look at the people that were in front of me or behind me. Uh, later in the race though, there was this very long there and back part and uh, yeah, that, that kind of worked very demotivating. It, it just seemed like it was going and going and the whole time I was thinking, uh, I have to run the entire way back again. At the start of this road on the other side of the course, I saw the 41K sign. So uh, when I did actually make my way around to it, I knew we were almost there and yeah, the finish was very close. The finish itself was a bit congested and uh, crossing the finish line was a little bit awkward. Uh, I wasn't sure if I had crossed the right mat yet uh, when I couldn't move anymore through the big crowd of people there. Uh, it also took quite a while before we got our medals after crossing the finish line. Uh, by that time my GoPro had run out of batteries so I didn't have the traditional uh, receiving the medal shot. The plan of the race was to take it easy, enjoy the race and run intervals of 5 minutes on, 1 minute off after my first 5k. Uh, I started out a bit fast but found my tempo fairly quickly. I started out doing the intervals and it went very well until I ran into some friends and decided to just keep running after about 22k. Uh, at 30k I started feeling my knee though and uh, yeah in the last months uh, my knee hasn't really been a problem but the day that i got to tokyo i kind of hurt my knee uh, i was dragging my luggage across the city trying to find my hotel after getting off at the wrong train stop uh, so uh, yeah that gave me some pain in my knee and yeah that started acting up halfway through the race it made the rest of the race fairly tough but even though i was hurting uh, it was still an amazing race. Uh, the sights of Tokyo, uh, the fun looking buildings with all the big Japanese signs on them. Uh, running into Kipchoge during the race was amazing too. Uh, the crowds, the course, uh, just the fact of uh, being in Japan, uh, everything added up to uh, a great marathon. Uh, I traveled there uh, with Sports Tours International. They also did a great job uh, making sure that Everything was amazing and everybody had an amazing experience. Uh, everything just ran smoothly. They also organized an after party in the evening with all kinds of food, entertainment and photo opportunities. Uh, it was a great way to celebrate the achievement of the day and a perfect end to a great week. Now for me, that is major marathon number five. Uh, so I only have Boston to go. So yeah, time to start training. Until next time. Get out there and run.